Hey guys, it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So here I am in my Hobonichi cousin. I am pre-planning for the week of April 3rd through 9th. And I'm actually filming this on Saturday, March 25th. The reason that I'm filming this is because we are going to be away and I'm using the kit from, oh my gosh, Paper Society Store, I believe it is, on Etsy. And she has these digital stickers that I printed off using my silhouette. So let's go ahead and get started. So if you guys saw my plan with me from last week, and I'll show you here quickly, my London spread, very bare because I'm gonna fill it in as we go. I'm not going to add in anything in here to pre-plan. I just wanna leave it pretty bare because once we go through life, that is when I will fill it out. So I really think these Paris stickers are beautiful. We're actually in Paris from the second to the fifth and then um, back home on the sixth. So actually the first thing I'm gonna do is take this airplane sticker and let's see, what times are like five. Yeah, I'll do that. So that's the day we fly back home. Um, but firstly, there's so many things I want to see in Paris. Um, but I also feel like we're, we're gonna do a tour or a walking tour on the first day, so on the third. And then we have a chocolate and pastry tasting tour on the fourth. And then we don't actually take our train back to London until that evening. So we technically have about three full days here. And I'm looking forward to that because my kids have never been in Paris, but they're currently actually in French immersion school. And I'm just, I'm, I'm just excited for them to experience different culture, and things like that. So what I'm creating here at the top is almost like my own little washi, but with all of these stickers. And if you don't have washi, why don't you just use all of these little stickers up at the top and create your own decoration there? Shoot, I started recording or I stopped recording and didn't turn the camera back on. So I've got some of these pair of stickers. I started decorating up at the top here with the stickers because I'm not using washi. I like using the stickers up at the top for decorative pur purposes. But what I'm basically saying is that, um, or what I was saying is that my children go to a French immersion school and I'm just so excited for them to experience the cultures of other countries and you know, my husband's never been to Paris, but he grew up in the UK. So, you know, that was interesting. Uh, I think it is here, so I'll leave that there. Mm. Okay, and then I'm just gonna place these all throughout the spread. Now, the thing is we are actually home these days and then it's Easter. So you'd think that I would decorate for Easter, but I'm not always like that. So let's, I almost feel like I should have put the Paris sticker somewhere else, but that's okay. Um, let's put this here. I'm gonna also create something similar just down at the bottom. Oh, merci and love. The Arc de Triomphe. Uh, okay, that sticker's going there. And yeah, so this whole week is gonna be dedicated to Paris, even though we're only in Paris really for the first half of the first half of the week. That's okay. I was going to use some of these stickers in my journal, but at the same time I was like, no, I want to just have a whole week dedicated to, wow, that's crooked, to Paris. So I'm going to place the baguette here because we have a chocolate and pastry tasting tour. That was a splurge, a total splurge. And there's no rhyme or reason, well, I say no rhyme or reason, but my, my thought for placing these stickers down is just kind of creating areas. So there's gonna be stickers at the top, stickers at the bottom, and then kind of randomly spread out through, throughout, mostly, yeah. It, it is all for really decorative purposes. It's, I'm not decorating it like I normally would be. Um, 
Well, I do know we have fish and chips with the family on that day, and then it's Easter Mass. So I'm going to put the Mona Lisa, even though we are not taking the kids to the Louvre. I mean, we'll probably take them to the outside of the Louvre, but not Louvre. But we're not going to actually go into the museum. We have so little time in Paris, and I want the kids to enjoy their time in Paris versus feeling like they're being shuffled everywhere and then not really remembering what they're seeing. So, hmm, that's okay. Oh, sorry for shaking the camera. Croissant. I'm just making fun of myself and um, because my sister and I were having fun with the whole croissant. Oh, never mind. And I'm going to put the bonjour up here. And I'm going to leave these ones for now. So what I'm going to do then on this side, similar to what I did with the London spread, is I will still keep track of my sleep and my steps. Oh, there's some ink leaking on that. So sleep. And especially when I'm on vacation, I think it's important to keep track of my sleep because I know that it's going to be a little all over the place. So there we go. And then steps. And then I'll just keep track of how many steps I do each day. So I have been to Paris before, and that was back in 2005 with my sister. Long, long time ago. And But my husband, who lived in London all his life, never went to Paris. And my kids have never been to Paris, and they're very excited. I think I'm just going to keep it like that. I like the stickers here. I like the stickers up at the top. Perfect. Just what I need. I don't want to add any more because like I said for my London spread I'm going to write things down as we do them so that it's almost like an itemized plan our memory planner where I'm just writing down what we've done. All right but that is it for me another very quick spread in my Hovenichi cousin. It's not really I say it's not a plan with me but it's a decorate with me so Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave those in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like button and to subscribe. Thanks again for watching and have yourselves a great day.